Alright. Um, I hope you guys have been having fun. We're on winners finals now. Uh, yeah, we've got Exus Miller. Top two seasons of the tournament. Uh, but we've had an interesting number of upsets. We've got CRZ and Carnage. Um, both having to meet each other in losing. Uh, Carnage coming ninth as a result, and then CRZ losing his next set uh, to Crescio 2-0. Um, as a result, well, as well, further, the Crescio is pushed to top four. Um, we've got Bowlby fighting hard to get to top four himself. He's playing against Tony right now, but to lose by Miller. Um, so, yeah, um, if Tony loses that as well, that'd be a number of really good upsets. He was looking fine form to be looking towards top three. Um, but, anyway, back to this. Luigi and Sonic. It's probably been a while since we've seen these two particular players play in this kind of format, but uh, it's definitely something that we saw at the start of um, Smash Bros. They, uh, they appeared in a lot of brackets. Um, we've had nerfs, we've had buffs, but here we are, and currently Miller is sitting in, in a bit of a lead. He's now going to try and see to uh, kind of Keep the box game up, uh, keep, keep it sound, try not to take too much damage, but this is going to use the namesake, the velocity, the speed to, to take the step. He's currently getting in now, he's taking the lead of oh, well, oh no, there we go. It might not be as efficient as we've seen, it might not be as cool rather than we've seen, but we just grab game. Still doing wonders for him. Get this into another grab. And nice read on his get up attempt there. Back of stage and oh, snipe from the back end. As the controller is now stopped down, and it is just going to try and do his best because he's been that attack on damage and cemented his feet. A blender attempt puts Miller in a precarious situation, but he doesn't get punished for it. He gets an option match, but it's not it's quite light. But that blender's going to kill. 7% is all that separates these two players now. Blender is just about stopping it. Bit that there. But he is a good deal behind and he's gonna have to work really hard this game. As you have noticed, uh, it is Lila for game one. As much as it is two stop, we're not going for the unified rules there. Um, as uh, some of you would have heard earlier, uh, things came up, and frankly, not done should even be on today. But here we are. Both players are fighting hard despite the changes. But it looks like Higgs is going to try and put some up. Oh no. Okay, Miller does get punished for that blender attempt too hard. But he can't really risk another one of those. If he does get him, and well, if he does miss and he does get him, then that will be this game. Trying to see uh, Miller try and read if attempt uh, to come in and pick grab like spot. Very formidable. Um, yes, a very formidable concept with Sonic's playstyle is the fact that he can cancel uh, his spin job and as a result, you never quite know when he's going to come in. You can be trying to prepare yourself, try and get the hard read, but 
he just goes, actually, in second floor, I won't come in this time. And if you throw out a lagging option, then that's it. Saying all that, we see it just game one. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, right. Um, so, CRC's just come back from um, from Schism. In Ireland over the weekend. A place four, a loss to Red Slasher and Winners, I believe, and Scarf Um But he was telling me an, an interesting tidbit that he'd learned out there. Uh, apparently, in Ireland, uh, they have this thing called, well, called the Dark Timeline. And their Dark Timeline is if Ryu gets the Grand and wins the tournament. Um, he was saying, I wonder if our Dark Timeline is if Crescio gets the Grand and wins the tournament. And he could potentially. He's guaranteed fourth right now, and he plays the winner of Zone Bobby, and he's got it in him to beat either of them. I, I think Zone's got uh, the lead in terms of it. Um, but well, two to Zone, and Zone just two to Bobby, so Zone will be beating the pressure in the semis. Um, but could it be that our dark time is player the pressure getting the grind? Like it's. I think it's been a while since he's got relatively close. Well. <laughs> wow! Uh, Ambler just put that uh, Kibsu won a twenty. That is the dark timeline. Wow! Alright, never mind then. And I've been rambling so long, I'm sorry. I should be commentating more on this game. Um, but, I don't know. I see, I see better in it. It's play a lot. And I don't really know what more I can say about it from what's happening in front of your eyes. What's happening in front of your eyes is Ixis has taken the stock. I'm about to say Ezra to lead, but he's taken the stock, which, has, which also means he's Ezra to lead. Uh, Miller's gonna have to do a fair bit of work, maybe a good read or two to take the stock, and Ixis is gonna do what Ixis does best. Stay in the lead. Now, he's taking the damage at uh, a last properly look, but uh, he's also probably put about the same amount on the same And oh my god, that was a little too high. I'm actually getting a bit concerned here for Miller as well. Wow. He's pretty close to the last line then with um, up B and uh, up there. And he can't see to get in against Ixus now. Um, we can not get in against something like that. And it's really showing because Ixus is slowly running away with this. Tries to counter his recovery option with up B, but it clanks and oh, He gets a reverse up smash to take Ixus' first stop. <laughs> and now we've just got people talking about various instances of the dark timeline. we got uh, Pelagos snapping up the UK with DDD. I'm not going to even say the one that Maggi put up there. That's too soon, Maggi. Um, what we've got in the dark timeline, Lou plays the game. We've been in the dark timeline for years. In the dark timeline, Flippy456, Bossman and Wallet form the anti-Discord alliance. <laughs> I like that one. That's probably my favorite. And uh, and in order to talk about dark timelines, uh, it just takes the set 2-0. Nope, that was game two, Mike. Right, so it just moves on to Grants. Uh, Miller's just going to be sitting tight in losers finals, where he now has to wait for the winner of Zone Lucretia. 
so let's get them on. Oh, they're getting on it. Hey, they, they know their stuff. They're, they're, doing, they're doing the good stuff. We have potentially four more sets of this tournament to go, and it's not even 10 o'clock yet. Uh, these guys have done really well. They've understand to the situation. Um, and um, they've, yeah, they've just embraced two stock, at least for today. And as a result,